Okay, this thing's working real good, guys. You know, I'm really, I hope you can see me. I don't even know if you can see me, but I hope so. Probably, you know, you should be able to see me. All right, this is called the Grand Deception. <clears throat> My children, how could anyone actually believe that the Illuminati in the New World Order is down with us? They are in collusion with every single one of our sworn enemies. They are in collusion with the Jews. They are in collusion with the Judean Christian Jesuit monsters. They are in collusion with the Muslims and the Hindus. Our law says it is only the good morals of what I approve. There is no representation of these to be found in them. These monsters create terrorist organizations to destabilize regions. They supply the organizations with weapons, ammunition, artillery, vehicles, training, technology devices, intelligence, military apparel, and narcotics. They create these organizations in an effort to destabilize regions, gain a foothold in the area, gain control of the political structure, gain control of natural resources, wipe out the bloodline of the Gentile, search for our ancient relics, impose sanctions on neighboring regions, provide sacrifices for the space rat termites, terrorize the people of that region, and to instill fear in us in our place of dwelling. This creates public sympathy so they can impose the illusion on us that we need to rely on them for protection from the same organizations that they created in the first place. Dum-dums. This illusion allows them to pass more and more legislation to remove our freedoms and rights from us slowly but surely one after the other. Once they have effectively completed their main objective, they turn on the same organizations that they created in the first place. They kill them and imprison them. Millions upon millions of people in our place of dwelling and many places around the world have died during the wars engineered by these scumbags. This is why everyone associated with our government or military or any military in collusion with them will suffer greatly. They have destroyed the names and memories of many righteous leaders throughout history. I have now decided to impose judgment upon them. Anyone who is involved with the military is guilty by association. I will, however, judge all terrorist organizations separately, and I will most definitely hear their complete side of the story, and I can tell you I believe I will sympathize with many of them. My children, can you not see this deception? The solid word of your Prince Michael. They created these imaginary organ. Oh, 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 I forgot to t listen to this. So, do, do, you know, I already told you that they go over there and look for our relics and shit. So now, in the Ukraine, uh, the dirtbags are trying to get over in there uh, because they just found all kinds of pyramids that are buried over there. And this is why Putin is trying to protect them. And that's why he's over there. So that's the real story. Okay. Now, I don't know what is so important about these pyramids. But there's probably all kinds of ancient relics down in there. And maybe some stargates buried over there. And who the hell knows? Yeah. Who knows? But I'm sure there's some kind of important shit over there. Otherwise, all these ding-dongs wouldn't be over there. And I'm not saying Putin's a ding-dong because I think Putin is a good leader. <clears throat> so, that's what's going on over there, my children. You know. 
36 pyramids they found, my children, buried. 36. Humongous, gigantic, monstrous pyramids buried under the ground because they were probably there. We probably built them in the previous shore. And once the planet came and destroyed everything, uh, they probably got buried and then whatever happened. They could have been from a couple shards ago. I mean, who knows? I mean, we've been here for millions of years, my son. Never mind all this garbage history that you're taught. There's a bunch of bullshit. Been here for a long time. Long time. Long, long time. Every time the planets come, and everyone gets wiped out. We come back and we facilitate life again. And that's what we do. That's part of our job. Part of our job. You know, <clears throat> when we come back, I'm not going to the dum dum dimension. All the devotees and anyone that comes with me, we're going back to our place of refuge. You know, but I'm still going to control, we're still going to control the dum dum dimension. The next planet Dingbat is going to send. We're not letting that all this garbage happen again. Forget about that shit, man. And then I'm, we're going to we'll take control of the generator again. And there's going to be no more adrenal juice junkie gray monsters involved because they're all going to be annihilated. Every last one of them. Unless they're on our side, you know, which probably some of them are. You know, because I already read the other thing, divide and conquer. Any smart leader would look for division among his enemies. So, it only stands the reason. Yeah. And plus, whatever decision Lucifer made, we have to accept it and go along. He's the boss, guys. He's the boss. He's the boss. He come. He tell me, bada bada, I want you to do this. I'm going to say, yes, my lord. Absolutely, right away. Whatever you want me to do. Whatever you want me to do, my lord. Believe me, like I said, guys, I could sit here and rant and rave and rip people to shreds. I mean, just ripping to shreds. If you guys, someday you guys are going to read what I wrote to the Space Rat Terminator, I tore them up. Why do you think they changed their mind? They probably like, oh my God. This guy scorched the shit out of us. I mean, I totally scorched the shit out of him. Like, Real bad. So they probably were so like, oh my God, they just thought about it. Wait a minute, <laughs> better think twice about what we're about to do. And they did. And that was a smart move. And probably they, some of the Vilans probably told them in the North, they probably told them, well, <clears throat> you can try to go down there if you want, but you, you're going to get an eyelid. We're not going to stand for it. I mean, you know. And we're not all here yet. I mean, <laughs> these guys are busy. They got all kinds of shit going on, my children. We're not the most important people in the whole universe. I mean, I mean you think we are, but we're not. There's other civilizations. There's all kinds of other politics and space politics going on and all this other stuff. You know, so they got other responsibility. You know, they, they facilitate life. There's other planets that are in trouble. They go through... You know, problems. I'm sure there's other planets. I'm sure they're not all holograms. You know, I'm sure there probably is some kind of space out there. I'm thinking that there is some kind of space place where planets are and shit. I mean, I know everything you see is just a hologram. Everything you see is just like a hologram. Like, it's not real. Like, you know, who knows what's real? I mean, <laughs> my children, the ceiling is made out of glass. I mean, what do you think is the deserts are made out of? I mean, they they went into the deserts and they took the sand and they investigated it and they said, well, this is glass that came from the ceiling. Why do you think the, 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 um, the what's that thing called? The space shuttle can only go in and out of the atmosphere at a certain angle and they build the space shuttle in a certain way with the tiles at a certain place because the thing, the space shuttle has to go at a certain angle, at a certain speed, and it actually melts the glass. And that's how it gets through. And that's how it comes back, my children. 
Why do you think Richard Branson, all his things that he built, he tried to escape, but they all crashed because they hit the ceiling. <laughs> you know, the military people, they didn't tell them. They said, oh, really, go ahead. And, you know, go ahead, try to fly away. <laughs> you know, and they all crashed. They all crashed. I mean, that's been mostly kept out of but yeah, it happened. So, all right. So I'm going to stop, man, and keep on trucking along.